Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here and welcome to another video. Ladies and gentlemen, today we have the new Team of the Season Saliba to check out. Uh, guys, listen, if you guys watch the Foot, uh, Foot Fantasy review, you guys know I like this card a lot, okay? Uh, and now that the Team of the Season has his own card and cards are significantly cheaper nowadays, uh, it's looking to be a W. It's looking to be a W. He is six foot four, medium high work rates, right footed, two star skill moves with a three star weak foot. Player traits. He's working with the power header traits, just in case you actually go for those uh, corner kicks and stuff. I personally don't know how to do them, but to each their own. Uh, now, Sleep on a Shadow Chemistry all guys, is going to be a lengthy player. So obviously, massive W there. 93 acceleration, 96 sprint speed is fantastic to work with lengthy while working with pretty much perfect defensive stats uh, with a medium high work rate. Uh, shooting capabilities does have an 82 for shot power if you actually want to utilize that power header trait, I guess. Uh, passing the card also going to be in a fantastic area for a card that you are going to mostly be playing in the center back position. So W passing stats for sure. Uh, dribbling. So low on agility and balance, yes, but high in reactions and composure, right? So he has 95 for reactions, 91 for composure. I don't care what you feel like on the ball. I care about what you feel like off the ball when you're my defender, because when I'm a defender, I'm passing the ball as quickly as possible from one side to the other. Uh, again, defensive capabilities will be essentially perfect. And then for physical capabilities, um, the card is also set up very nicely in that department too, except for jumping. Okay, so except for jumping. So we will see what this card performs like in game. Hopefully he is a beast. A challenge. Not really a challenge, really, just kind of... Oh, I forget, I have to pause the game because my settings reset when you chill in the lobbies for too long. Ooh, I like that aggressiveness, Saliba, I like it. Oh, I was going to get the ball, but I tackled really poorly there. The challenge. We get to that. The attack fizzles out. Well, no surprise there. The hosts have enjoyed most of the possession and have used it really well today, particularly in the mid. See, I overcommitted that, and I wanted to kind of like commit it to that space afterwards, which he still catches up really well. Trippier. On to Carlos Alberto. Chance to cross. Ah, uh, couldn't get a block off there. That's what I like to see, Saliba. Right there, that one pass nonsense. I like it, Saliba. My boy. Oh, it's a roulette, man. I know how to do skill moves, EA. We're good. Okay. I, I will I will gladly take people out to not let them go for the uh, counterattacks. My boy Saliba had it there, but worth. Good, it's not a red, and he takes him out. I'll take it. Hold on, Saliba. Hold on, Saliba. That track back is amazing. 
Roy Keane plays alongside Bruno Guimaraes in central midfield. And up front, Harry Kane plays... Nice. Just holding all trigger works there. Will we see from them now? It is now with Jorginho. And it might be. It has to be, surely. And it goes! This law is so nuts, man. Today, depending upon circumstances. Early challenge of an illegal nature, and the referee can't ignore it. Well, there it is, the first caution of this match. Well, he didn't need to make the challenge, did he? He's under pressure now. It's a long time. <laughs> Uh, you know why I do that? I just want to get like a header with him if I can. I feel like that might be him. I'm not 100% sure it is. Okay. I didn't expect it to be hit that much. <laughs> I don't know how to do the quarter kick stuff, guys. You know me. I'll collect that quick, keep it going. Yeah, see, that's what I wanted to try out. I wanted to try out the uh, push out of position, let go of him, see what his track back is like. You can see his running animation is boom, 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 boom. Like, this guy's just running. And the glitch Bappe is glitch Bappe. So listen, that's all manual controls right there. So the fact that I can tackle, get out of the tackle and go into a defensive play right away again is awesome. Like, you can see how quick he transitions from the tackle, gets up, runs right away. See? I do, I literally do it on purpose. I push him out of position just to see what he does, and he does a great job. He just tracks back. Animation was good enough to block that out. Look, look at his positioning. Switch to him now. Well, it switched me to uh, right back, but. Oh, we're just scoring bangers right now, huh? Sounds good. Sounds good, my brother. Dude, the transition speed's great. Like, dude, I don't know if you guys ever watched my uh, foot fantasy review for the card before the upgrades, but I really liked him a lot. And uh, this card so far is no different. He's a very, very good center back. That is, hey, like I said, team of the season, they, they put the price significantly lower for a lot of these cards uh, because obviously they're involved in like foot champs rewards and all that kind of stuff. But yeah, no, he's been he's been great, man. Look at that movement. Push him now. I'll trigger. Just to block it. Good to go. Get that block off too. Look at that transition speed. Look at this. Look at this. There's like, there's no like restriction. Look, see? It's just smooth the whole time. Look, smooth. Go into the play right away. You're good to go. Look, even the manual running is good with him. Look at that. And I could just do that myself. I, I actually get rewarded with the manual defending. That's awesome. Okay, guys. So final verdict on the new team of the season Saliba card. So guys, listen, man. It was like I was mentioning in some of the other player reviews for the EPL team of the season. 
honestly, 85% of these cards are really cool for the price value that they're at because you guys remember when I reviewed this uh, Foot Fantasy card, right? His Foot Fantasy card was amazing. Like, it was an amazing card, you know, in comparison to the team of the season and what it is nowadays, it's plus ones and twos. Um, obviously, when it comes to the team of the season version, he has improved stats in certain areas. It's definitely a really beneficial thing, like the physical and all that kind of stuff, right? Um, what's so interesting about a card like Saliba is that as of right now, and he might keep going down in price, who knows, it's incredibly fair value for what he offers in game because Saliba is genuinely a good center back. Like he's really, really solid to use. Um, everything, again, bounces off this card really nicely. He has good acceleration and sprint speed considering the fact that he's a lengthy player on a shadow chemistry style with near enough perfect defending stats on a medium high work rate with a high and average body type w there but not only that this card also works with fantastic physical capabilities the only thing that you genuinely have to be mindful of when using this card is going to be in the jumping department right because with pace, it's important to always have pace. You guys can see his transition speed is great. His positioning, generally speaking, is fantastic as well. But jumping with an 82, even though he's a six foot four player at a high and average body type, some players that have a six foot two body type or a six foot two height with you know higher jumping stats, like a 90, 92, sometimes those guys will be able to get the ball over him. But this is like really nitpicky because it's mostly for that corner kick tactic, okay? Mostly. If someone crosses the ball in, for the most part, we did a pretty solid job because his height, doesn't it doesn't make him jump high, but he kind of just does like an animation where it allows him to get the ball anyways, right? So um, I still like Saliba. If, I still think he's a great option to, to get. If you get him in your foot champs rewards, honestly, W. If he's one of your red picks, he's going to be a card that lasts you a very fair amount of time playing the center back position. So uh yeah, the, like I said, the Premier League team of the seasons, like there's only been like two or three that I've been like, whatever. And then the rest of them have actually been really solid to use in the top tier division. So some good stuff, man. Some good stuff. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video today. I'll catch you guys for the next one. Peace out, dudes. Love you guys.